Hey guys, it's Ron and Jim here, bringing you more content from the Dallas RV Show. And we're going to take a quick peek at a Hero Ranger. Uh, we're going to take a look at a Heartland Cyclone and another Forest River Wildcat. Stick around, check them out. Get in. Here's a, what is it? This is the Hero Ranger. Show price is 33.94. So this is your no fridge overlander trailer. No frills. No frills. No frills. No frills. Mm -hmm. yes. Hi. Yeah. Peek at it. Nice. Oh. This is beautiful. We got a three quarter ton. So. Oh, yeah. You don't like any shapes, do you? No. Oh. It's funky. Smaller. Uh, I'm going to go take a look up here. This one seems larger. Than the other one? Yeah, it seems like you got, got more hiding room in here. Move around. Same heads up. Yeah. Side. This the slide is on the driver's side, or on the passenger side. Well, and if you look, you come up on this side. Did you realize that? Uh -huh. Yeah, I do like. I think that's really cool. Oh, I just saw it does have a toilet paper holder. You don't see it. It's integrated. It's not down here where you're gonna bump it. It's up here. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> I still like the way I situated ours. I like right, you just drop it on Yeah, there. no, I, I definitely like it. doesn't fall off your own head. Yeah. Radius I like that it has two ACs. Mm -hmm. All right, they're leaving, so if we want to stay in. Okay. Let's see how it goes. I mean, it, it definitely has a ton of storage. For no. a smaller fifth wheel, for sure. Well, because it's got the storage, you know, this is all one slide, so the, Part of your storage is in the bathroom, part of it's in here. Mm -hmm. See, but I mean, I know it's a fifth wheel, I know it's bigger, but it doesn't it's feel like it's that much bigger than ours. Exactly. Yeah. Decent storage. Decent storage. And we just happen to have ours that goes to the underbelly. Yeah. You know? And... Ow! Yeah, fall down the stairs. But I mean, I, the kitchen's nice, you know, it's... Um, it's what I've got. Yeah. Look, this would be... What is that? Uh, trash can underneath. Oh, neat. So, and, this, and I'm guessing... Okay, it's actually accessible from outside. So, when you take your trash can... It can hold one. Deep drawers, those are nice. But this setup is like our trailer it's not, right now. It's not bad. It, it reminds me of some of the cougars that we've seen. Exactly the same setup as what we had in our current travel trailer. Yeah. And entertainment. But I don't like, I, I just, there's something about it I don't like. Is it that clunky wood out there? Well, it just, I mean, it's a very modern look to it. It's, I like this though. I like it gives you the but for the price point, and the U shape doesn't really bother me. But the problem is, is this is this is two, maybe three people. It's not, you know. I'd rather have the couch no, where I you like have. The way our, our travel trailer set up because that whole back area is our bathroom. Yeah. You know, and then you get a smaller bathroom and a fifth wheel, and I'm just like, okay, I'm moving up in the top. We want certain things. I want. A decent bathroom. Yeah. Yeah, something that's not a regular. Yeah, I don't like, again, I don't like the brass. Yeah, I, I saw that on the inside. That's so cool, though, because <laughs> if you're outside, you just chuck it on in there. But this again, you, it's, a, it's the tight. And with the uh, outside fridge. Yeah, because that's what we have right now. Yeah. We definitely want to 
All right guys, so we are checking out a Cyclone 4006 toy hauler. You got your got happy, jack. happy jack system with your garage. Moves down, and then there's a bed up there that comes down. Got cabinetry. Oh, this one's got a loft. Oh, it does have a loft. Top. And you've got a little half bath back here. So this is a tiny, oh, this is to make privacy for your, you know. Is it a wet bath? No, it's just a half bath. Oh, okay. It's just a potty and a sink. Yeah. After you get dirty outside with your toys or something, toy holler. Oh, wow. I was not expecting this. So you got... A little galley okay. kitchen. We got a U-shaped kitchen. Now, this is not my favorite. Because... But look at the it's cabinets. A one, but, honey, this is a one hiney kitchen. Yeah. True. You can't have two people work it, and, and my hope for getting a bigger trailer, fifth wheel, whatever, was to have something that both of us could stand in without mm -hmm. having to go, excuse me, pardon me, and bump the other person out of the way. Well, and they put a massive fridge in a tiny kitchen. Nice convection microwave. Tons of storage. Oh, yeah, for sure. And look at all. See, half the storage, or two thirds of the storage, I would never be able to reach. <laughs> You know, I, I did a store in the kitchen for some years. Look at all the things. No waste, no waste. They've got cabinetry for you everywhere. Cabinetry for Let's see, this is single sink, single basin sink. Got drawers. Very nice, deep drawer. Check out the accent lighting right here. Okay, if that accent lighting ever went out, some more so you've got <laughs> two love seats, three love seats. Ooh, they're very comfy too. These they're, are they all recline. These are TV watching. You could probably. I wonder if you can recline these all the way to make them a bed. Wait, that one has. Okay, these are recliners. These. Okay, so oh, that's a. Oh, this is that's a fold out for a. A bed. Yeah, that's a bed there. These are recliners here, and the ones behind you are recliners. Alright, what do we got here? We've got a little control panel hidden behind that, so people like me don't fall into it and press every single button. You got your one control system from the Lippert up here. On the well, that looks like a tiny bathroom. It is. It's it's like a, excuse me, pardon me oh. for yourself. There's no change in clothes in here. No. But you do have some decent storage. When we get around here. It's kind of a triangle storage. It kind of goes back like that. It's very weird. Um, that's the same. Got drawers, another cabinet. Come with me. <laughs> so we've got a tilt a bed here. That King size bed, but no. Tilts up when it comes in, when the slide comes in. Um, no yeah. end tables. No end tables, no pedestals, no little shelves. So if you have a need for a CPAP or something. You do not have space in here. You'd have to learn. And the to closet. To fix it somewhere else. Closet looks bigger than it actually is. It's pretty. It's a step up too, which is different. You've got nice shelving back there. There's plenty of hanging room, but it's just not as big. Sure. This no is room. great. You still, even though there's the outdoor stuff out there, you look you still get some storage mm -hmm. you could still you know you could still stack toiletries or other things in there so there's no course. room for a tv in this bedroom <gasps> for shame <laughs> i do like it it's luxe oh it's definitely nice but i mean this is perfect for somebody who wants their toys. They got a TV right here. You don't have one in the bedroom. I bet you could put one in the, in the, the garage, though. Oh, I'm sure. You know, it's got that loft up there, oh, so I'm sure. Look at these cabinets. Did you? No. Oh, this is your pantry right here. And again, look how this deep is that not is. For people my height. <laughs> I'm five four, and I cannot. That's reach what this. step stools are made for. Yeah. You know, I carry one everywhere we go. The chalkboard paint. What's your drunken octopus hooks? Oh, 
Got a little chocolate. outdoor kitchen. The liquid chalk marker. Right. What's the point? I mean, seriously, that's not considered stereo speakers. They're right next. Well, and they're they're not they're not the same height either. Lots of good storage. Sorry to complain. But look, they're not the same height. One's lower than the other. That's gonna bother me. 